What's good, sneakerheads? Welcome back to MG3 TV. But before I get into this review, make sure you go ahead and subscribe and like the video. Now today we got another sneaker review for you guys. These just came out this past weekend, you know, the 11 lows. Came out in two colorways. I didn't get the navy ones, I didn't really like them that much. They reminded me of the Georgetowns a lot, which I, I mean, they're, they're cool, but there's something that wasn't for me. So I went ahead and I got the, um, the Cherry 11 Lowe's, Varsity Red, whatever you want to call it. Let's take a look at the box. It comes in your standard Jordan box. This is the size tag. Size 10, Air Jordan 11 Retro Low. Of course, you got the colors, white, Varsity Red, black. Bam, there you have it, the Air Jordan 11 Retro Low in that cherry red, varsity red colorway. Now you got the all red patent leather around the toe, along the sides. Got your Jumpman in the back, the 23 printed on. And you have a, uh, it's like a red jump man on the inside of the shoe. Then on the inside of the tongue, it says quality basketball products inspired by the greatest player ever. And of course, with all 11s, you know, you got the one, two, three. Jump man Jordan on the third spacing right there. You got the whole mesh upper in all white. And you know, that's going to get dirty real quick. <laughs> I know my Concord lows, it got pretty dirty pretty fast. That's my only problem with like mesh, uh, all white mesh uppers that they get dirty so fast. But what can you do? Hello? And of course on the bottom, you got your uh, herringbone traction pad. Got the little pods right there. Jumpman, let me turn around. You got the Jumpman, of course, a little another pod, the herringbone traction. You got your carbon fiber. Sounds like the police are banging at your door. One thing about the, the bottoms on these, it's not like a super icy blue. It already kind of has like somewhat of a, I know it's kind of hard to see on camera, but in person they kind of have somewhat of a yellow tint to it already. So I think that's just kind of, they're kind of looking for that, you know, somewhat of an aged look on these, which I actually do kind of like. Sometimes certain retros don't look all that great with like super, super icy blue bottoms. So. I do kind of like the somewhat of a yellow tint on these. Yeah, so I like these a lot better than the navy ones. I think the navy ones are really cool. They look nice, but if I have to pick between the two, I'm going with these all day. And plus with last weekend, you know, getting the flu games, and then this weekend, I got these. And then you've got the Yeezys coming out next weekend. Let me tell you, it is an expensive month. Alright, so that'll do it for this video, guys. Just a little quick review. I know there's so many reviews out there already on these, but just want to give my take on it. Um, and of course, you know, just sharing my pickups with you guys. Let me know if you guys got yourself a pair of these, or if you got the navy ones, or both. And of course, we got the Yeezys coming out next Saturday, so, um, I mean, you know I'm going to take the L. I'm going to take a big L, as a lot of us are, but of course, that's not going to stop me from trying. So uh, hopefully I get them. Let me know if any of you guys plan on picking them up, and if you do, I hope you guys get them too. Now before I start this uh, on feet, please go ahead and like the video and subscribe. I'll catch you guys later. Peace. Fuck that, we gon' get it all this year When I snap, I'ma leave them all in fear Where I'm at, the path they never look so clear Some people I used to fuck with, well they